That I said would not be the only couple. We <laughs> I don't give you wrong updates before. I'm even oh. paying attention to like his ring finger. The next person that I would have actually like put up on that mission is Anita because they're sort of like similar. Welcome to your custodian lock-in. Hi guys, very quick update. <laughs> Chinwe has sworn that she's not going to rest until she finds out an information, a valid information about Cassie Ray and Cassie's relationship because she said she can feel and she can sense that Cassie and Cassie Ray are actually couples, okay? In fact, they are married, but they are pretending to be besties. And this is so, so true. Baby girl is on a mission, okay? She has made up her mind that she's going to plot against Cassie Ray. Okay, she's going to team up with some girls, you know, fair ladies, knowing fully well that Cassie Ray's wife is a fair lady, okay? So she thinks that the guy has a spec with fair ladies. So he's going to pair up either Anita or Victoria on a mission. She's trying to work out a plan to know if Cassie Ray is going to fall for any of the girls. <laughs> Oh my days, this season is indeed no loose guard. This lady Chingwe said she's not going to rest until she carries out this mission. So she's telling her boyfriend about the whole thing, about her plan. And the guy is also in support. In fact, the guy was even giving her suggestion. <laughs> and the guy said maybe she should go for Ruti. Because Ruti seemed like a person that... Once she likes something, she goes for it, okay? I'm like, come on. Come on. Cassie Ray, you are in trouble. For you guys that are married and decide to come and be playing besties, it is over for you. I really cannot wait <laughs> to see how that dynamic will play out. But the big question is, will Cassie Ray fall for all these things? Knowing fully well that his wife is around. <laughs> I really cannot wait. Chiwe is such a vibe. She's such a vibe. And I'm loving her already. The way she's so, so certain. Like, she's so certain about this thing that these two people are married. And she said she's noticing the guy's, you know, ring finger. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Wow, and it's so funny or shocking to me that none of the housemates have noticed these people aside from Chingwe and her boyfriend. <laughs> hey guys, what do you think about this thing? I really cannot wait to see how this whole drama will unfold. And also, Chingwe mentioned that she's having a day, you know, she's feeling somehow. And on Twitter, a lot of persons have been saying maybe she's pregnant. <laughs> because of the whole lockdown thing that was... Before they came into the show, they were on lockdown. And according to what the housemates were saying, the lockdown was between pairs. So it means Chingwe and Zion were in the same room. And you know now, you know now, things will definitely be going down. So people are saying maybe they get up carrying Belen before she entered the show. Oh my God, people are so funny. One of the activities Big Brother you know, planned out today is custodial locking. As we all know, the Indian won the custodian challenge yesterday and big brother has given them the power to influence the game for the week and also immunity the locking is just all about them bringing out the box they got yesterday and the box contained three boxes three smaller boxes okay they are meant to choose one from it and whatever they choose from it to be reviewed on sunday big brother informed them that as a custodian they can either choose to play the challenge or decline if they decide to play each box comes with its pros and cons okay but if they decline or refuse to play the game they will lose their custodian uh, their custodian title and immunity Hey, I'm like Biggie. Which kind can be this one? <laughs> you want the custodian title. You are with the custodian box. Now you are telling us the box contains, you know, pros and cons. But anyway, whatever this is, Big Brother will reveal it on Sunday. They accepted and they, you know, 
chose one of the boxes they chose the box that contained the white paper all right and just like i said it will be reviewed on sunday whatever that is in that paper whatever the content it is will be reviewed on sunday wow so far so good housemates are coming through energy here and there you know we're beginning to see you know some friction here and there people are beginning to get on each other's nerves but it's still very subtle okay because today while they were you know having their lunch there was some form of you know back and forth going on in the kitchen which is actually very normal there is no season of big brother Nigeria that food will not be an issue it should definitely be an issue and having 28 housemates in one house <laughs> is gonna be a lot of issues all right so guys i'm loving the season i'm loving the housemates you know some persons have laid back a little but some persons that seem to be very active viewers seem to have problem with it and i mean onyeka I've been on Twitter, Instagram, and people have been commenting saying that she's doing a lot. I thought we all agreed that this season that we don't want anybody that is stalling. We don't want people that will come and be sleeping. Onyeka is trying to vibe and you know get to know people. Now they are saying she's doing too much. So what do you guys think? If you've been watching the show since yesterday, do you think Onyeka has been doing too much? I'd like to hear your opinion. And what do you think about Chinwe's plan? Chinwe's plot? I am here for it, guys. It's going to be very, very interesting. I hope this plan works out. out because we'll really know if this guy is a faithful guy or not. 